Babs and Besties! Today, we are taking a look at Rainbow Junior High. The Rainbow High characters in Junior High form. Go back in time and meet your favorite students before they became friends and followed their creative dreams to Rainbow High. This is Series 1. We have Violet Willow, Skylar Bradshaw, Jade Hunter, Sunny Madison, Poppy Rowan, and Ruby Anderson. I bought them at Target for $24.99 each. And I was able to balance them to stand, some better than others. Each doll comes with a comb and a backpack. They stand a little over nine inches tall, making them smaller than a regular Rainbow High doll. Even though they are smaller, they still have the details we expect to see with Rainbow High dolls. Check out Ruby's backpack. For one, it's made of fabric. We have nice little straps here, faux buckles, that's cool. It does open and there is Velcro on top to keep it closed. The gold stitching, the faux leather details, the little patch, the R that dangles. There's even details on the back. What? A Rainbow High doll can fit the backpack as well as dolls from other brands. I like it with our little made to move mermaids mermaid. Ruby has bright red hair, inset eyes, eyelashes, has the front pulled up into a ponytail with a scrunchie, two hair clips. They look like gold bobby pins making an X. She has a gold colored necklace with an R on it, wears red overalls that say sparkle, Aw oh, man, mine has a hole in it. I have the worst look. They are really cute overalls with lots of details like little pockets. And all of the pockets are functional. There's even pockets on the back, which I think are adorable. They are rolled at the bottom. She has on socks, which is so cool, and shoes with painted details. She has a long sleeve shirt, which is awesome, with two different colored sleeves and little details at the bottom. <gasps> and the buckles actually work on her overalls. They're so small though. I'm not very graceful at this. This doll is fully articulated with movement at the head, shoulder, elbow, wrist, has painted fingernails, can move at the hip, twist at the upper thigh, bend at the knee. I love that even though the dolls are smaller, they have the same articulation. Poppy has orange and pink hair. There is a nice amount of product in it. The front is braided. She has little butterfly bows on the sides. Love the freckles. She wears an orange blouse with some nice bell sleeves, little ribbons, white shorts with orange stitching, working pockets, belt loops, all the little fun details. She has an orange top underneath with ribbon straps, high socks, and boots with painted flowers. Her backpack is brown and orange with lots of faux leather, a little butterfly on the top. I think that's cute. It's actually really, really soft, which is cool. Overall, very cute look. The shorts can fit a petite made to move body perfectly. For me, the orange top, not so much, but a yes on the blouse. Sunny has yellow hair with painted edges. Her hair is styled in two knots with the back hanging down. There's a nice amount of product in it. She has two rainbow hair accessories, a plastic jacket with little pockets. Each one has a little charm inside. They are sewn clothes. There is a faux zipper in the front. She has a white t-shirt with a sun on it, wears a yellow skirt with faux buttons, pockets and belt loops, socks with little emojis, and some rainbow shoes. Very easy to get the top and skirt on a petite made to move body. I had some trouble with the jacket. Might try again later. The Rainbow High Junior High doll or Rainbow Junior High doll has removable hands, so it's a little easier to get them dressed. And I got her to balance better this time. 
Her backpack is cute. It's clear with little printed patches and there's a little rainbow decoration. And there's little extra rings on the sides. So we can place seed beads on wire, curl the ends and attach it to the bag to make another little keychain. Here's Jade with a shorter green hairstyle. The top is pulled up into two ponytails and we have leather scrunchies. Well, faux leather with silver stitching. She has a band-aid on her nose, a white, black, and green sleeveless top, green boy shorts with an elastic waistband, green and black pants that say rainbow, pockets, belt loops, faux buttons, socks. I'm loving that they all have socks. Sneakers with painted details. On the back, they say no rain, no rainbows. She has a green and black animal print bag with a little grayscale rainbow there. That luggage tag is too much. Love it. Skylar has blue hair with lighter blue highlights. The front is pulled up into a bun with an orange tag. She wears a blue hoodie with silver details. And this right here actually moves. That is cool. There's a cute little design on the sleeves. She has a jean skirt with faux buttons, pockets and belt loops, socks and blue sneakers with an orange tag. She has a blue clear backpack with iridescent flaps, silver buckles and light blue faux leather and a little luggage tag as well. Violet has an adorable look, probably one of my favorites out of the whole lineup. She has shades of purple in her hair, styled into two ponytails with fluffy hair accessories. She has bangs, a neutral lip color, wears a soft cardigan with a white button-up shirt underneath, has pretty long sleeves and ties in the front. The shirt velcros in the back. She wears a pleated plaid skirt, knee-high stockings, pearly white and pink shoes with silver on the front. She has a satiny lavender quilted backpack with silver and purple straps. It closes and opens with Velcro. There is a faux drawstring and the word rainbow stitched to the bottom and printed on the back. Did I mention that I love the fact that even though these dolls are smaller, they're still articulated? Their faces have a matte finish, definitely giving all the feels of a rainbow high doll, only a little smaller. Hmm, I wonder if they could be good body donors. Since I didn't find a perfect match for this Mermaid's Mermaid doll, let's give Rainbow Junior High a try. It's just a little experiment. We can always change them back if it doesn't work. I place them in some hot water to soften the head so we can remove it. Put on the new head. I don't know. I think I still like the Barbie body better. But here is the junior high head on a standard rainbow high body. And I like it. Giving our rainbow high dolls a slightly smaller head. And I gave in and went ahead and put the mermaid's mermaid head on the classic made to move body because it's a better match. I think I'm going to keep Skylar as a Rainbow High, Rainbow Junior High hybrid. The Rainbow High body can fit the top, not so much the skirt. So I just borrowed a skirt from the original Skylar. And now she's just the taller girl in class. Overall, I think Rainbow Junior High is pretty cool and a great addition to the Rainbow High world with all the accessories and articulation. Thank you for joining us while we took a look at Rainbow Junior High. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell and follow us on Instagram at My Froggy Stuff, the Frog Vlog, and Bella of My Froggy Stuff. And we will see you next time. Bye!